Hey guys, do you think personality quizzes actually work? I was thinking about this a while back when Infinity War came out and there were all those, you know, which Avenger are you personality quizzes floating around? And the, like, the sheep-minded person I am, I inevitably ended up taking a whole bunch. And see, I didn't really have a problem with them until I took one and the result I got was Doctor Strange. Which I thought was weird, I'm not at all like Doctor Strange, so I just dismissed the quiz as bad because I just thought it wasn't accurately understanding the answers I was giving. I had that thought, you know, do these things even work? Like, it seems to me most people go into personality quizzes with an idea of where they're going to end up, and if you're mostly surprised by your result, then you're normally not happy with the quiz. Whether it be a character, Hogwarts house, or just type of bread, we all carry a presupposed idea of where we think we belong. So, it seems to me that half of people take personality quizzes for some kind of external validation about our perks and flaws, because, you know, it's nice to see the standard, you are a kind and caring person who deeply values friendship, or, you know, something along those lines. But there's another type of person, you know, who might not always be the best judge of themselves. I remember in high school in particular, and sometimes even to this day, I stop and think about the questions too much. Especially when there's a huge disparity between the answers, like, do you consider yourself a nice person? And the answers are as following, no, people know I hate them, sometimes, and yes, everyone looks up to me for my kindness. Like, in high school my confidence was pretty low, so I would sit there for like 15 minutes being like, I like to think I do my best to be nice, but then the other day I did this bad thing and I actually tripped over someone and stepped on their foot. No, I must be a bad person. You know what I mean? It was like a mini existential crisis every question. Now, of course, I kind of just know that, oh, all these answers are really meaning or like how many points they'll put into the nice meter. So I try to lean into my strengths and stress my faults. But as a result, I already probably know what it's gonna tell me. In that weird way it reminds me of astrology, the difference being people hate astrology, like adamantly dislike people who reference or refer to astrology, saying that people who look for their own truth in the results or that it's dumb, etc. And honestly I think that's just because it's connected to some form of spiritualism, while personality quizzes uses the word quiz, which makes it seem more academic, more logical, and thus more accurate, when you know people are ultimately doing the same thing. So yeah, I mean, I think it's fine, there's nothing wrong with external validation, you know, in whatever form it takes, but I just thought it would be interesting to talk about. Have you ever taken a personality quiz or something like it that you felt was super accurate or, you know, felt surprised by and happy with the result? I one time took this, you know, 100 question D&D &D quiz and I really liked it, so, you know, I guess there's mine. But that's my weird thought for the day, thanks for watching and sharing, and I'll see you all next time.